So I guess switching gears, mm. did you guys hear about this like deep fake story that happens? I think today or mm. yesterday. No. So yesterday for us, but it'll probably be like three weeks for the audience. Yeah, three weeks, three weeks for the so audience. So facts may come out. I mean, uh, yeah, totally I, I have not. So like with deep fake becoming like such a big, th or like a bigger thing now. Mm. So I, I, uh, I can't, we're, we're gonna go back to this. I like, <laughs> can't remember every can't detail remember. of the story, but I think the main gist of it was there was this mum mm. and she had a daughter who was on the cheerleading squad. Can I we get Maylene to check the story while we're talking about it? Yeah. Just Google deep fake news. That'll be like yes. a top story. So I, I believe there was mum who had a daughter who was on the cheerleading squad. Mm. Um, and there were other girls mm. on that cheerleading squad. And for some reason she wanted the, she wanted to kick these other girls off of the squad, right? So what she did is she made some deep fakes for, like of the other girls. Like smoking, yeah, drinking. Yeah, like smoking, being drinking. Naked, I think. Oh, doing, wow. doing like bad illegal activities or whatever. Right, right. And I think threatening them with it, right? Yeah. Or like, I can't remember if she threatened them or she sent them straight to Not the Not sure school. how she did it, but yeah. I think they, they saw it. And the reason why it got even found out was because they took it to the police. Like yeah. A few of them went to the mm. police. Yeah. And how she got found out was she used the fake number. She used like this internet service that gave them, a, gave her a fake number, but that didn't hide her IP address. And that's the only reason she Cut got found sponsor. out. <laughs> 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 this, uh, this episode is sponsored by- <laughs> you, know, you know, I don't think she would have got caught if she was sponsored by- <laughs> 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 I don't think our sponsor would be very happy. No. That's why we're not gonna mention any names. Yeah, but I mean, I, I saw it and I'm just like, well, I can't believe they actually took this long you for something what, like this to happen. You know what the most unbelievable part of the story is? That there's a mum out there that's tech savvy enough. Cause my mum- That's was, what I thought. My, you, I don't even think my mum knows what a fucking deep fake is, no. let alone how to, she doesn't even know how to search for files on Windows. I'm actually <laughs> impressed her mum knew how to make a deep fake. No, because uh, I'm impressed- like, what? <laughs> I'm impressed that mum knew how to do a deep fake, but I'm even more like, because, okay, um, I. Not sure if any of this is confirmed. Mm. So I'm gonna put out a disclaimer that- We could be totally wrong. This could be, uh, yeah. please check this Do story. Do your own the research. Time yeah, by, of filming. By, by the time this comes out, all right. Okay, all right, go on. I'll tell the story while but I can't by, by the time this come out, comes out, everything might be confirmed. This might all have been like false information or it, it might've just been like claims. But mm -hmm. at the time of recording, we don't know if it's real or not, but these are what the allegations are. All right. uh, and the allegation was that she did this because the daughters on the cheerleading squad, she stopped hanging out with her daughter. <laughs> and so she, she wanted to get them kicked off because of that. And I'm just thinking if someone's this petty to be this crazy, oh, how dare you are not real. How, how does she manage to figure out how to do deep fakes? They all, she also sent them anonymous messages telling them to, that they should, you know, end their own lives as well to the, these kids. Oh, the mum did that? The mum did that. What the fuck? This fucking, how, this is some fucking- Some people are not supposed to be like, parents. This yeah. is so like cartoon villain. It's like, it's so <laughs> absurd that someone could be this <laughs> fucked. Oh my God. Yeah. But I'm, I mean, I saw that and I'm just thinking, my first thought was I'm one, I'm surprised that it took this long for something like this to happen, right? right. This mugshot looks like she's tore someone's face off. <laughs> oh, oh my God. God. That, she I, looks I mean, like a Disney villain, doesn't yeah, she? Yeah, Ma Maleficent just ripped someone's face off and stitched it. That's like- I shouldn't uh, say that, it's probably too, going too far, isn't it? That's like, that's like Actually, the- Actually, no, fuck you. you just <laughs> 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 Telling kids to, what? what that actually yeah, yeah. looks like she's that wearing is, someone else's face. Oh my yeah. God. You know what that's more concerning about that? That was someone's parent. Yeah. yeah. Holy yeah. fuck. Imagine being raised by someone like that. Holy fuck, that kid's gonna be fucked. The, yeah, the, the kid's gonna end up like that. But, oh apparently, but, apparently, but apparently the kid knew nothing. Like the mum did this without telling the kid. She did this by herself, so. How, how, do, how do you even tell the kid like, the kid's like, are you, you cool with this kid? Are you cool? No, I'm not. <laughs> mum, what's wrong with you? <laughs> there's, yeah. a, there's replying back to a, a nasty tweet and then there's creating deep fakes. Please, please don't tell my schoolmates to go kill themselves and make deep fakes <laughs> when I them. When I would tell my mum that I was being bullied, she wasn't thrilled about it, yeah. Yeah. but she was like, you know, I'm not happy about this. I'm yeah. like, I'm putting a word to the teacher, but it's, you're on your own kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is your problem. You just learn exactly. to deal with it. Like, I can't deal with this shit. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> like, I mean, fucking hell. That's, okay. That's so, scary. Like, I mean, it's just so many of these, the, the parts of the story is actually insane yeah. that this could happen. It is literally like a horror movie plot. It like, is. You can't yeah, make, what? This is, this is kind of like, it's, just, it's almost too cartoony to be a Black Mirror episode. 
That's what, that's what <laughs> I think. It is, it is. It's so like, if this was a Black Mirror episode, you'd be like, yeah, twist's really predictable, like really, really <laughs> yeah. over Can, the top. Like, yeah, I mean, like, like, it's like, like a B grade horror film, right? Like, the mum's kind of an unbelievable villain here. She could have used more character development, more motivation. No, this is reality. But what scares me is that, like, what what does this mean for the future of deepfakes now? Because like mm. uh, this week especially, I, this new app's come up where it's gotten really easy to deepfake. Yeah. You know, deepfake. You know, use use it for memes. Use it for harmless memes to yeah. make people sing fucking Bakamitai. Or- I mean. You know, oh. we're, we're used to, you know, people doing fucking terrible photoshops or doing stuff yeah. like that. Yeah. So if someone sent me a video of me doing something I clearly didn't do or right. never ever did, I'd be like, I don't really give a fuck. I'm, it's fake, right? Yeah, and yeah. I'll say it's fake and yeah. that'll probably be the end of it. But to someone who's never really had anything online or any kind of like, you know, posted anything about themselves outside of like their personal Facebook, I can see why receiving a video that looks like you doing something that you didn't do could mm. be fucking terrible. Yeah. Right, Absolutely. Yeah. and that you would think that wow, people are really going to believe this, even though yeah. you know realistically they're probably not going to. If you explain that it's fake, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, it's it's gotten to a point where, like, for people like us especially, where we show our faces on camera pretty often. It, it wouldn't be hard to make a convincing deep fake yeah. with you know uh, us coming on camera I, literally every I, week. I, I think we all uh, we all agree on this that you do not have permission to make any deep fakes of us, and we don't condone any of them. By the way, just yeah. saying that <laughs> you're legally not allowed to do that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, is there anything legal that's you know that yeah, you can't, you're not like, I think legally speaking, you can't like just do that. Yeah. Um, depending on what jurisdiction you're in. Yeah. So I remember Tom Scott did a video about it. Right. Um, mm-hmm. I think I think the laws around it are a bit iffy and obviously stuff like this always takes because time. Because it's such a new thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, 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 a, it's a really new thing. Cause like, but, you know, I've seen like the Bucky Mitai deep fakes. I'm just mm-hmm. like, you know, this is funny meme, whatever. Yeah. But then I don't know how would, I would feel if I saw the, like, you know, the KSI Ainsley Harriet deep fake. Cause that's, that's, no, that's, that's so good. Though. That's, that's so, good. so good. It's funny as fuck, but then, <laughs> Also, some, so some, something yeah. at the back of my mind, which makes me like, that's fucking worrying. That yeah, how good it like, is. How good it yeah. is, and I'm glad it's been used as a funny meme. But yeah. my god, if if I saw if I saw my face on somebody else like that, I would just think, damn. It, I'm glad this is being used for, for a funny meme, but yeah. this could be used for something that's really and Luckily, harsh. right now, as many deep fake things are being made, there's just as many things that are detecting if deep fakes have been made, like mm. programs that are being written to detect them. Mm-hmm. So right now it's like, it's a lot of softwares will detect when the when it, it's a deep fake. Mm. Yeah. But we, whether it will get to the point in future that it, that it isn't do, so do, do, you th- do you think like it's only a matter of time before we get our first deep fake cancellation? No, oh. I, th- I think we're quite far away from that. Right. I think, I think there's still, too rough and the technology isn't there yet, but I think it's possible within like- I've seen some deep fakes that are really fucking convincing though. But like the the videos are like always in like 480p max. Right. Like, and- But that's like kind of the video you'd expect for, I don't know, like the kind of phone quality exposed videos. Yeah, They're yeah. never like 720p, 4K. It's always like fucking <laughs> PlayStation eye camera. Quality, <laughs> but I right? think the, the more, the easier it gets to cancel someone from a deep fake, the less canceling will happen because everyone will be like, it's a deep fake. Is it a deep fake? Or everyone's gonna defense is gonna be, it's a deep fake. Yeah. yeah. All right. But that, like how that, long- That video of me punching a baby, deep fake. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing, no. how long until the deep fake argument is going to be legitimate, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, the moment that you can cancel someone for a deep fake is when that argument will become valid. Right. Because yeah. they'll be like, oh, I mean, you saw you saw that deep fake, it was, yeah, it was a deep fake. It's a really good deep fake. <laughs> <laughs> Looks so <Yeah>. real. <laughs> Oh my God, I can't believe it yeah. myself. <laughs> Our world's gonna become a lot more messy when it gets there, unfortunately, yeah. but you know, it's- uh... Yeah, I mean, there's nothing, what's scary is that there's nothing to stop the technology being out there. Mm. But I mean, I, I guess you can argue this for a lot of things. Cause I remember when, you know, 3D printers became a thing and then- I, Well, you can still 3D print guns. Yeah, you, exactly. You, you, can, you, <laughs> you can, can still it. 3D print guns. You shouldn't, but yeah, you I mean, you, you shouldn't, and I believe it's illegal, yeah. right? Uh, well, it's it's most the laws like, around it are real weird. I think. I think really? I think what it is is that there's most uh, 3D printing machines can detect if it's like the blueprint of a gun or a firearm or something, and just yeah. not. Print well, it's it like out. a Photoshop. If you put a picture of the the dollar bill in, mm. uh, they won't let you do anything to it. Yeah, it'll like stop you. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I had no idea about that. They, yeah, it's, it's so they don't want you to Photoshop it to like try and like you know because the software is so powerful. Yeah, print, Photoshop print is, out free yeah, money. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Photoshop is really powerful tool, yeah. and the stuff that they're constantly adding to it is just you know adding to the repertoire of how strong it is, and it's mm. like very concerning. But then again, you know, it's like when Photoshop first started as well. Like we were all yeah. like, oh my god. People are going to be like, it's it's crazy, you know. Like, the, the, everyone's going to start getting cancelled. They're going to be people are going to put Nicholas Cage in orgies. Although that's really I mean, that's, that's, that's not unrealistic. <laughs> <laughs> Bad example. <laughs> we've, we've 